how to create registration form in HTML. So first we will see output. So this is a registration form in which uh, <coughs> uh, username, uh, email id, okay. and uh, password is given okay so how to create this okay so password is in form of dots this is checkbox this is text box this is uh, email control these are advanced form control this is password control or uh, and this is checkbox and this is push button that is submit button now how to create this <coughs> So, I will show you this. So, this. <coughs> so, I will remove so that you will understand each and every line. So, how to write this? <coughs> so, these are very basic tags. These are necessary tags. Now, uh, to create any form uh, controls or form elements so form tag is necessary so form is also an element so we will write now heading tag so that we want to display heading registration form so one by one we'll see output first we'll save the file in between you have to go on so i had already given name but extension for HTML file should be always dot HTML. Give any name but dot HTML. Now we'll see. So this is heading and uh, <coughs> color already I had given in body tag. You can give any color to text. Now we will write because we want a new line. So we will use BR tag or H1 tag does not require BR tag. Username will write. Okay, now we'll see output. Now we want text box below it. BR tag is used to break the line. So we'll see now. Uh, input tag is used to create uh, form elements or input elements, input type elements, input type. You have to write equal to so write text so by this text control is created or text element is created max length you can give max length of uh, means number of characters how much you want to enter suppose 30 and size is display size of text box suppose we will not write first this we will see this so this is text box but we want to suppose increase the size of text box so write uh, size so that is display size of text box suppose i see 25 save run so now text box size is bigger so this is text control now we will uh, use next line that is we want email id so we will write now we'll see output now we want email on new line so which tag we have to use we have to use br tag before that so br tag now we want email control input then type so these are advanced input this is advanced input type email uh, it does valid validation if you uh, write invalid email id when you click on submit button that time validation is done whether you had written uh, properly this is a name of control or element you can say <coughs> so we'll write any name you write just mail i'll write you can write any name <coughs> save it run it Okay, so this is, now we want a new line, email control, that is this box for email. So now see, okay, so now we want uh, password, so again we want a new line, so write password.
password. Now we'll write br tag for new line. Next. Now we want to create a password control <coughs> that is advanced input element or form elements also they are called or form controls so right here password now we'll write give any name to this control why name is given because if there are two password so how to identify that box so we have to give name to this control okay this is password now we want text box to remember the id so we'll use br new line now sorry next we want text box uh, that is check box so input type is equal to so if i write type check box by this check box control or element input element will be created name any name you can give suppose i write c1 value also you can write okay now we'll see so this is check box now and to write uh, after that that is remember password or accept terms and condition you can write anything related to registration form now we will create that is submit button having label as registration so validation for email because email is advanced input control uh, or element so on submit if you have invalid email id if you put then it will give you error message so label will give to means if you write this way the label will be see this way i want in new line so it will give label as it is uh, what you had written sorry what you which button so if you want to change the label default label is submit only for submit button so i want to change the label so write value is equal to registration it is upon you what label you want but this is work of sub submit button only okay so we will uh, this text box uh, so now we will try to enter the value so information information email id suppose i write hello and if i just leave it okay i had not written any website name for gmail okay and password automatically it is entered in form of dots means it is displays as dot this is check box okay so when you click here so here validation is done for email control so if i just try it this way and i leave it without entering dot so it is validated means at the rate you have to write some name so you can see the program so i'll explain you so input a uh, tag with a type is used to create a control so text is used for text box control you can have many attributes here like name value uh <clears throat> input type if you write email it will create email control these are extra attributes uh which is necessary when you are doing uh, programming or developing sorry developing websites um, and if you, that is then that time <clears throat> it is good practice if you enter name attributes extra so input type password is created uh, it creates password control input type check box it create check box control so you can see the program and by input type submit it creates a submit button label can be given by read this and uh, end you have to always do 
form is to create any of this control very first tag after body tag is form and you have to close form tag before body tag so you can see the program see first is input type text box max length means how many characters you want size is size of text box name also you can write here so subscribe to my channel to get more updates <coughs> suppose st student name okay this is a internally used when you are doing any calling these controls these are called also controls this text box email okay so you can uncheck check so hope you understood subscribe to my channel to get more updates thank you